Hello, everybody. Good evening. Good evening. Hello, good evening. How are you? How is everybody? Hola, ¿me escuchan bien? Yeah. Okay, very good, very good. Okay. Eh, muy buenos, buenas noches a todos. Um, solamente quería comentarles, um, ahorita he tenido un inconveniente y como pueden ver, no estoy en el lugar donde... Eh, normalmente les doy la clase, pero eh, pues me he logrado conectar. Um, entonces uh, vamos a, a tratar de, de pues, dar la, la clase con lo más de manera posible, pero quizás porque um, para eh, que no haya inconvenientes ahí con los datos que estoy utilizando, uh, voy a quizás mantener un poco apagada la, la cámara de vez en cuando para que no a entender ahí con el sonido, aunque sí, eh, de por sí creo que um, hay un poquito de, de problemas con el sonido, ¿es correcto? Sí, yes. uh, se escucha como doble audio, repitencia de, o como eco. Como un eco. Um, ok, pero ¿sí me logran escuchar? Sí. Yes. 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 Ok, yes. Bueno. Okay, vamos a ver, voy a ver si apagando la cámara eh, mejora un poquito, ya vamos a ver. Ok, mientras tanto lo que vamos a hacer es que vamos a tomar la asistencia, ok. Así de que, por favor. Um, Uh, Andrea Geraldine Sanchez, vecinos. Andrea Geraldine Sanchez, vecinos. Creo que me permite, ¿Cómo? Ah, no, sí, tiene razón, tiene toda la razón. Perdón, chicos. Okay, I will see. Okay. Okay, I stopped. Aaron Alberto Peralta Martel. Aaron Alberto. Adriana Beatriz Rodriguez Sosa. Present. Eh, Ana Mercedes Solorzano Najarro. Gracias, Miss. Blanca Rosa Hernández de Rosales. Blanca Rosa Hernández de Rosales. Daniel Osvaldo Aquino Correas. Daniel Osvaldo Aquino Correas. Eh, Dora Stephanie Mejía Mejía Dora Stephanie okay, uh, Edwin Adonai Jans Calderón Edwin Adonai Jans Calderón eh, Eloisa Abigail Ortiz de García Eloisa Abigail Ortiz de García. Gloria Elizabeth Orellana de Mayen. Gloria Elizabeth Orellana de Mayen. Present teacher. Oh. ¿Dónde está? Acá. Ah, ok, ok, perfecto. Muchas gracias. Ok. Ya la veo. Okay. Um, 
Henry Oswaldo uh, Quintanilla Lopez. Henry Oswaldo. Hugo Adalberto Orellana Vides. Good evening, teacher. I'm here. Okay. Thank you. Um, Jose Angel Hernandez Lopez. Present teacher. Okay, thank you very much. Um, Juan, Adal Juan Alberto Cabrera Herrera. Juan Alberto. Eh, Catherine Stephanie Salazar Serrano. Present. Wonderful. Thank you, Catherine. Catherine Jamilet Aviles Garcia. Present. Okay, thank you. Uh, Kenya Vanessa Funes Espinosa. Kenya Vanessa. Eh, Kevin Adrián Rodríguez López. Kevin Adrián. Kimberly Natalie Contreras González. I am here, teacher. Thank you. Eh, thank you very much. Uh, Marvin Alberto Morales Solórzano. Present. Okay, thank you. Um, Maynor Alexander Santos Solís. Maynor. Okay. Pamela Noemi Pineda Ayala. Maynor. Pamela Noemi Pineda Ayala. Why? Pedro Natán Ramírez Andrade. Why? Present teacher. Thank you. Thank you, Pedro. Uh, Rafael Antonio Aguilar Carpio. I'm here, teacher. Present. Thank you. Uh, Romeo Antonio Gutierrez Cerón. Okay. Eh, Romeo, ¿puede encender su camarita? Eh, en unos minutos está enciendo. Eh, para, la, para la asistencia, no más ahorita. ¿Será posible? Ok. Thank you. Um, seguimos. Dutel Carmen Rosales. Okay, thank you very much, Ruth. Sandra Guadalupe Alparo. Present teacher. Thank you, Sandra. Sonia Janeira Garcia de la Cruz. Sonia Janeira. Victor Manuel Argueta Rauda. Ok, thank you, Victor. A uh, Yanira Guadalupe Pumi de Rivera. Present teacher. Thank you very much. Y Judith, uh, Judy Edith Chávez de Rearte. Judy Edith. Ok. All right, so what we're going to do then is we're going to continue Pronto, with. Teacher. Perdón. Yo falté. Ah, Eloisa. Eloisa Abigail. Okay, thank you, Eloisa. All right. Okay, so what we're going to do right now is we're going to be. Um, we're going to continue from where we left off. Um, yesterday, we were learning a little bit about the simple past, uh, the questions, specifically the questions. Okay, um, for just a moment. Please. 
Hace un momento me acabo de conectar, creo que ya me había pasado lista. Ok, Henry, eh, ¿será posible que pueda encender su camarita? Ando muerto, teacher. ¿Ah? Desde ayer. Ando muerto desde ayer, teacher. Creo Anda que muerto. Como bien, sí. Anda muerto Estaré y está, como bien, está conectado. Ah, está, está difícil eso. <risa> Estaré bueno. como oyente, nada ¿no? más. Ajá, ok, bueno. Eh, acuérdense que, que, eh, que sí, para la asistencia es importante la, la, la camarita para que podamos confirmar ahí que usted está ahí, ¿verdad? Y que realmente es usted. Ok. Ok, porque acuérdense que es, esta parte específicamente es para que el sabor tenga registro, ¿ok? Bueno. Continuamos. Entonces, we're going to start there. Yesterday, we were talking about the attendance. Sorry, the attendance. Sorry. The, um, the questions. The questions with yes or no answers. Remember this? You remember this, guys? Yes, teacher. Yes? yes. Okay. So, um, what we're going to do is we are going to um, put this into practice. So yesterday we learned that we need to have the auxiliary did, okay? And then the subject, the subject can be any subject, I, you, he, she, it, we, it doesn't matter, okay? It doesn't matter what the subject is. It's always gonna be did. So that's the, the beautiful thing about it. You can always put, did I, did you, did he, did she, did it, did they, um, did we, it doesn't matter. And then after the subject, we're going to put the verb in the original form. So the base form of the verb, no change. Don't put had, don't put has, don't put any other form, just have, okay? Or play, or like or go, okay? And in the answers, it's always gonna be yes or no, right? The subject, for example, I or she or they. And then if it's affirmative, we're gonna say did, okay? So yes, subject did, or no, subject didn't. That we're gonna answer. So that's what we saw yesterday, just a little bit. Okay, so what I want you guys to do now is to put this into practice by completing the conversations. Here we have conversations with questions, also short answers and complete answers in the affirmative or negative form. Okay, actually there's no negatives, sorry. No negatives, just, just affirmative ones. So um, I'm going to be sending you this through WhatsApp so that you guys can have it. And I want you to work on it with your, with your group, okay? Um, okay, so let me, let me send it to you guys through WhatsApp and you can tell me if, you are able to see it, just give me a moment. Okay, do you see it? I already sent it to you, did you? Do you see it in the group? Yes or no? Lamira? Yes. Yes. See? Okay. Yes. Okay, good. So I, right now what I'm going to do then is I'm going to um, send you to breakout rooms. Okay. Um, so that you can work on this together. Um, I'll put you into small groups, maybe groups of three or, yeah, three people. Um, and uh, you can do it together, okay? I'm gonna give you about, um, I would say eight minutes, 
Let's give you about eight minutes to do it. I think I think you should be able to do it in eight minutes. Okay. So here we go. Let's open the room. Sonia, Eloisa, Henry. Hola chicos, ¿se han podido meter? ¿Se han podido meter chicos? ¿Tienen problemas para meterse? A mí no me sale nada, dicho. No le sale nada, ok. No. Déjenme ver si lo puedo. Solo escuché que le íbamos a. Ok, lo voy a ver si lo puedo mover. Sí, sí, sí. Oh, ok. Eloisa, ¿qué hay de usted? ¿Le sale otra cosa? Eloisa, ¿está ahí? Hola, Sonia. Luego tiene, tiene que conjugar el verbo. Ajá, luego lo que sigue. I have agreed. No, I have. I had. Sí, porque es el pasado. Ah, ok. I had agreed. Ajá. Summer. I just, I just relax. En pasado. Uh, relax. En pasado. Relax. Relax. Ajá. Ok. Entonces sería, yes. Yes, I did. I had agreed summer. I just... I just relax it. Sí. Vaya, voy a okay. did, sí. did you go anywhere last summer? No, I didn't. I stayed here, but my friends visited uh -huh. me. Sí. And on the weekends, we... Uh, yeah, y cuál sería we go go out a lot eh, yo veo que dice go out ahí no sé si sería went went out a lot ajá we went we, we went out a lot sí Vaya bueno, la siguiente. Sí. Did you take any classes last summer? Yes, I did. I take tennis lesson and I play okay. what's, what's tennis the every day. What's the pass of take? What's the passive take? Take is an irregular verb. Take. Talk. Take it. No, no talk. take it, no. It's irregular, so talk. it's took. Oh. Exactly. Yeah. Okay. Took. I took tennis lesson. Yes, correct. I took. Okay. And I played tennis every day. Okay. Teacher, una pregunta. Y ese go out, ¿cómo sería en pasado? Um, 
go, okay, so in this case, go out, it, you use exactly the same form as go. So what's the path of go? Went. Yes, correct. So it's going to be went out. Went out, ah, mm -hmm. okay. Exactly. Okay. Thank you, teacher. Bien, You're Marvin. Welcome. Seguimos con el... Marvin, seguimos con el número cuatro. Did you, yes. did you speak English last summer? No, I didn't. But I... I use a verb, si me cuesta, read. Read, read. Cambia. Eh, la escritura no, la pronunciación nada más. Okay. Read. Back, I read. read English book and I watched English movies. Eh, watched. 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 Como conté al final. Que... Okay. Watched. No, watch. Eh, no, conté. Watch. Watched. Watch English movies. Yes, watch it. Okay. Si gusta, repita la última parte, Marvin. Vaya, sería... No, I didn't. But I read English book and I watched English watched. movies. No, el watched is watched. Okay, sería I watched. 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 Conté al final, watched. Ahí me cuesta. I watched. Okay. Como que le falta right. English. Sería, I Marvin, siga, siga en el sonido. Watch. No, 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 solo el sonido. Muy bien, otra vez. Ahora. I watch. No, 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 solo el sonido, solo el sonido, Marvin. Ok. El sonido de la T. Ajá, muy bien. ¿Otra vez? Ok, ahora pónganlo junto. Watch. 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 Watched. Por ahí vamos. Watched. Richard, eh, al final es como la lengua con los dientes. No, como una T. ¿Cómo, cómo, ¿Cómo pronuncia la T? T. No, la, solo el, la, el sonido de la T, no la letra T. Sí. <risa> Entonces so es watch. Watch. Yes, exactly. Perfect. Okay. Watch. Okay. Watch. Yes, exactly. Watch. Again, watch. Watch. Yes, perfect. There you go. Estamos. Okay. Perfecto. Thank you. You're welcome. Okay. All right. Continue.
¿Cómo seguimos, Ángel? ¿O ya terminaron? Sí, sí, te eché, esa era la número cuatro. Ah, ok, perfecto. Entonces, ya, ya estuvo, ¿verdad? Entonces, no voy a devolver a la sala principal. Está bien, Tichero. Gracias, Ángel. Okay, can you see my screen? Yes, teacher. Yes, teacher. Okay, great. Let's check the answers then. Did you have a good summer? Yes, I did. Very good. Yes, I did. Yes, I did. Mm -hmm. This I did. I <coughs> have the. I had. I had a great summer. I just relaxed. Relaxed. I just relaxed. Next, next question. Did you go? Very good. Did you go? Anywhere. Did you go anywhere <clears throat> last summer? No, I? I didn't. I didn't. I didn't. I? I Say it. I stayed Say. here. I stayed here. But my friends visited. 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 Is it it? Is it it? This is this is one of the ones that has the extra syllable, okay? Because it visit finishes in a t sound, so it's visit. So, como ya termina en la en el sonido t, verdad? La sonido de la t. Entonces, para diferenciar entre el presente y el pasado, tenemos que tener una sílaba extra. Entonces decimos no solo visit sino que visited, visited, okay? Everybody, visited. 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 Very good. Next. We went out. Went out. We went out a lot. Very good. We went a lot. out. It, Whenever you see, um, whenever you see verbs that have like words like out, um, up, down, no, 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 no se, no se preocupen por esas palabras up, out, down, todo eso. Um, solamente con el verbo. Por ejemplo, en este caso es go out. Entonces el verbo es go. Entonces, eso es lo que vamos a hacer en el inglesio, ¿ok? La, la jugación va a ser así, con el go. So, it's going to, what is the past of go? When. 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 Hmm, good. Went. So, the past of go is when. So, you say when. Oh. Ok. Next. Did you take? Good. 
Did you take, take, did you take any classes last summer? Yes, I did. I did. I did. Exactly. Very good. Yes, I did. I took. I took. Very good. Don't forget, take is the is an irregular verb, so you need to put. It's not take it. Take it. No. Take take it. No existing. It's took. 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 Mm -hmm. took. Correct. Took. 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 Next. Um. I took tennis lessons, and I played it. Played. 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 Good. So the pronunciation is not play yet. Play it, no. It's played. Played. Acuérdense de la clase de ayer. Solo hay tres terminaciones. El sonido de la t, d, o id. Solo eso hay. No, no existe ed. Ed no es, ese, esa terminación ed no existe. La terminación, o sea, la pronunciación de la terminación es ch, ch, o ed, pero no ed. Ed no existe. Ok, next. Yes, played, played. Ok, number four. Did you speak English last summer? Did you, did you speak? Did you speak? speak? Speak. Okay. In this case, it's speak, not spoke, because speak. you remember that in the questions, the auxiliary is in the simple past. So the verb it does not have to be in the simple past. Did you speak? Did you speak English last summer? No, I. Didn't. I didn't. Very good. No, I didn't. No, I didn't. I didn't. I? I read. read. Okay. Yes, I know that it's the exact same spelling, but it's even if it has a, the same spelling, the pronunciation read. is is different. You pronounce it. Read, read. Okay, so I, I read English books. English. Okay. Red, like the color, the color red. Red. Okay. Next. Did you, okay, so English books and I. What? 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 Okay. Acuérdense que no existe el, el sonido el. No podemos ser watched. No decimos watched. Decimos watched. Watched. Si ustedes vieron el video que les mandé, yo sé que algunos ya lo vieron, ¿verdad? Pero otros quizás no. Si vuelven a repasar el video que les mandé en el chat, podrán escuchar allí que se puede... Um, se puede combinar dos sonidos con, de consonantes, ¿verdad? Entonces, so lo único que tenemos que hacer es acordarnos cuál es el sonido. Entonces, por ejemplo, acá. So, um, let's say here. Um, okay. The sound here is ch, 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 okay? Y the sound over here, ¿se acuerdan que, que cuando, cuando no, no hay una vibración, ¿cuál es el sonido? ¿Cuál es el que usamos? 
ti. ¿Sí ¿Se acuerda de la clase de ayer? Sí. 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 Yo sé que la, decía ahí una T, pero no es la T, es el sonido de la, de la letra T. Entonces sería como cuando uno, por ejemplo, dice uh, tomorrow, tonight, eh, together, uh, Tommy, Tony, um, uh, quiero ver acá, Tuesday. Okay. Ese sonido no es, no es la letra T que vamos a pronunciar, sino que el sonido de la T. So, it's going to say, watch, 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 everybody, together, watch, 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 very good. Okay. All right, perfect. Any questions? Do you have any questions? No. No? No. Okay, perfect. All right, so in that case, what we're going to do is we are going to stop presenting in a moment. Okay, please tell me if you can see my screen. Yep. You can see my screen? Yes. Okay. Yes. Yes. Okay, so here we have um, a, a pictures of celebrities. So we have, um, I don't know how to pronounce his name. I think it's Issei Miyake. Issei Miyake, he's a designer. Then we have Shakira. She's a singer. You all know. I know. I'm sure you all know Shakira. Then we have Cho Young Fat. He is an actor. Then we have Selma Hayek, who's an actress. I think you also know Selma Hayek. And then finally we have Ronaldo. I'm very sure you all know Ronaldo. He's an athlete, specifically a soccer player. So. Where were these people born? I want you to match the people with the country. Where do you think they were born? You understand? Be born? Yes. Yes. Yeah? Okay. Good. So where do you think they were born? I'm going to give you a minute to, I, to identify and then we can talk about it. Okay, you ready? Yes. Okay. Um, all right, so let's start with um, Issei Miyake, a designer. Where do you think he's from? He. He, he was born in Japan. Okay, very good. Exactly. He was born in Japan. Excellent. He was born in Japan. What about Shakira? Where was Columbia. she born? Colombia. Colombia. Very good. 
Oh, no, sé, I, no sé por qué escuché London. <laughs> Digo, no, no para nada. Okay, good. She's born in Colombia. What about Cho Young Cut? Where do you think I, he was born? China. 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 Very good. Remember, it's China, not China. Okay, it's China. 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 Okay. All right, good. Where was Salma, Salma Hayek born? Mexico. 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 Very good. Mexico. Um, don't forget, it's you say Mexico, not Mexico. Okay, because it's in English. Mexico. And Ronald, Ronaldo, where was he born? Brazil. 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 Very good. Notice that it's Brazil with a Z, not not an S. Not like in Spanish. In Spanish, you, you spell it with an S. But in, in English, you pronounce it with a Z. Brazil. Brazil. Okay? Okay. Very good. Now, um... Do you know of any famous people that were born in El Salvador? Alvaro Torres. Alvaro Torres. And what does he do? What is what what is his profession? He's a singer. He's a singer. Very good. Anybody else that you know uh that was born in El Salvador? The fame a famous person? Nobody? Claudia Lars. Huh? Claudia Lars. Claudia Lars, okay. All right. And what's her profession? It's a poet. It's a what? It's a poet. A poet. Okay. Very good. Yeah. Very good. Anybody else? Oh, Jim Floyd. It's a singer. Who? King Flip is a singer. Oh, King Flip, did you say? Yeah. <laughs> oh, okay, okay. All right. Sure. Yeah, King Flip, he's a singer. Good. Anybody else? Any fame any other famous people that were born in El Salvador? There are well, um person working in the NASA. Mm hmm and do you know his name? Because I forgot. <laughs> I know who you're talking about, but I forgot his name. Anybody know his name? I don't know the name. Okay. Okay, well, okay. So those are some people that were... Now, why is this important? Why are we talking about this? Because when we're talking about uh, where people are born, we use the past of B. Why? Because when you're born, you were born in the past, right? You can't be born in the future, right? So every time we talk about where people were born, it was, we're talking about where they were born in the past, okay? You know, in Spanish, donde nacieron. So let's take a look at this conversation that we have here. Um, let's listen and repeat. Okay. Um, let me make this a little bit bigger for you to see it a bit better. Just a moment. Okay, I think you can see it better. Si lo logran ver mejor? Yes. Yeah. Okay. Yes. Perfect. All right. So listen and repeat after me. <clears throat> Where were you born, Melissa? Where were you born, Melissa? I was born in Korea. I was, I was born, born in Korea. Korea. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I, oh, so you weren't born in the U.S.? 
I so you weren't born? Yes. So you weren't born? Yes. So you weren't born, born in the US? In the US? In the US? No, I came here. No, no, I came, I came here. here in 1999. Mm, you were pretty young. Mm, you were oh, pretty young. You were pretty young. Yes, I was only 17. Mm, mm, yes. Yes, I was only 17. 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 Did you go to college right away? Did you go to college right away? No, my English wasn't very good. No, no, my English wasn't very good. So I took English classes. So I took English classes. English classes. English classes. For two years first. For, for two, two years. years. Well, your English is really good now. What? Well, your English is really good now. Thanks. Thanks. Then. Your English is pretty good too. Your English is pretty good. Your English, your English is pretty good too. It's pretty, pretty good too. Yeah, but I was born here. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I was born here. Very good. Excellent. All right. Okay. What questions do you have about the vocabulary? Do you have any questions about the vocabulary? If you do, write it in the chat. Only that? So, born means when you came to life. When you were in the, in your, when maybe you were in the hospital or your mom was in the hospital and you came to this world. Okay? So, you were mom, your mother was pregnant and she, when you came out of your mother, you were born. How do you say born in Spanish? Nació, nací, nacer. Nacer, nacer, very good. Okay, good. Came, came is the simple past of come. Okay, so if this is a irregular verb, that's why it's came. Okay. The past of come, come. What is come? Venir. 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 Come is venir. Okay? All right, next. Right away means immediately. Immediately. Okay. All right, do you have any questions about the pronunciation you can write in the chat
All right, let's practice. 1999. 1999. 1999. Todos, todos, chicos. Escucho a una persona. Everybody. 1999. Good. Donk. Donk. College. 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 Where? 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 Okay, so now that we know that, let's um, let's uh, remember a little bit about what we talked about. Esto ya también lo habíamos visto anteriormente, pero vamos a hacer un pequeño repaso. Um, ya lo habíamos comentado cuando hicimos un repaso de el simple past. Uh, so the the simple past of B is it's like irregular, okay? So acuérdense, acuérdense lo que les decía anteriormente de que el verbo to be es un verbo que siempre eh, rompe las reglas. Es uno de esos verbos rebeldes porque siempre rompe las reglas. Entonces no no decimos no, por ejemplo, el past, el past de, de be, no es be, ¿ok? So, normalmente diríamos, eh, le pondríamos solamente la de, entonces, pero eso sería, sería otra palabra, sería ser, que es cama. Entonces, no, quebrantan la, ley, la regla. Entonces, the past of, of be is was or were, ¿ok? We use was. For okay. we use uh, B. Uh, uh, si quieren podemos apagar todo el micrófono. Podemos apagar todos los micrófonos, chicos. Hola. hola, hola. Todos me pueden hacer el favor de apagar todos los micrófonos. Thank you. Okay. But this is, uh, so the past of 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 what of be is was or were. We use was. Actually, let me change the color. We use was. Um, with I. With he. She, and it. Okay. We use were with you, we, and they. Okay. Um, so don't forget. He and sh and it is also in this category. Okay, so he, it, and she. He was 17, 
it was 17, she was 17. Okay. Now the negative form, the negative form of was is was it. Okay, which can also be used with he, she, and it. So I wasn't born in the US, she wasn't in college. Okay. And the simple the simple pass of B in the negative is in the negative plural is this weren't. Okay, so you weren't, we weren't, they weren't. Okay. Any questions about this? Do you have any questions? No? No. Okay. So let's see if you understand this. Vamos a ver. Okay, so vamos a completar esto. So we're going to work together on this. My family and I were all born in Korea. Vamos a hacerlo juntos, okay, para que no nos cueste demasiado. Okay, so my family and I were born in Korea. We were well. okay. We well. weren't we weren't born. born in the US. We weren't born in the US. Okay. I was. was. I was. I was born in the city of Ichon. Ichon. And my brother. Where? Where? No. Okay. My brother. My brother is it I, you, he, she, it, we, or they? My little. He. He. He, my brother is he. And this he. is he, yeah? he. Was or were? What? Was. 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 Porque con he va, was, right? So my brother was the born L. there too. My parents were. 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 Because remember, were. my parents and they, they weren't. So my parents weren't born in Inchon. They were. 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 Good. They were born were. in the capital Seoul. Okay. ¿Qué tal? ¿Entendimos? Yes. Yes. yes? Any questions? No questions. You sure no questions? No. No, it's okay. Okay. All right. I think you understood it too. Okay. Very, very good. Vamos a entonces dejar de compartir. Okay. Bye. Entonces, chicos, eh, llegamos hasta el final de nuestra clase. Eh, solo un recordatorio que necesitamos que se conecten todos el último día de clase porque acuérdense que también requisito su asistencia, ¿verdad? Para, para poder uh, cumplir con uh, todos los requisitos para poder pasar el curso y poder tener, obtener el diploma. Entonces los esperamos siempre el día de mañana y um, eso sería todo, ¿ok? Any questions? Anything before we begin? We sorry, we finish. No question. Okay. All right, guys. That's no it. Questions. I will see you tomorrow. Okay. Take care.
Bye. Good night. Bye. Bye. Bye.